What's up, you guys? My name is Mary, and with High Priestess Intuition, welcome my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash this up button to be notified for future readings. This is free general collective reading for all signs, cut through size, everybody in between. Um, don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. Fluid. If it doesn't follow the plot, everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate and leave rest. Free general collective reading for all signs. Um, I received another channeling in. They're just flying in tonight, so I'm here. Just saying, just saying. Um, it's a good one. It's a good one. So um, that's good. Um, thanks everybody for all the love and support to the channel. We're at thirteen thousand and um, three hundred and seventy-five. Let me confirm. Hold on a second. Yeah, 13,375 subscribers. So thanks so much for all the love and support to the channel. If you'd like to donate, it's High Priestess Tarot 5. The link's in the description box below. PayPal only, no cash out, no Venmo. It's a very private, confidential way to donate if you choose to donate. I love and appreciate each and every one of you guys. And thanks, everybody, for all the recent donations. I truly appreciate it. Just want to let everybody know. Okay, so, um, oh, and a quick update real quick, too, before we get into it. Um, um, I... I found out today that my core date, um, my core date was supposed to be on Friday. It's um, now it's to be announced. We don't know when it's going to be. So um, I'm just, I'll keep you guys updated when I know. I don't know when it's going to be. So um, it was supposed to be this Friday and now it's to be announced. So just to let everybody know for anybody's interested. So um, just to let you know. Okay, so we're going to get into it. Um, the channel message I heard was a very, very, very imbalanced situation regarding money, wealth, property, and finances um, through many series of chain of events. It's about to be evened out for some. For some, it is in um, career opportunities and growth. For some, it is in love. Through many series of chain of events, it's about to be evened out. For some, it's in all. For some, it's in all. Okay, so for some in all spectrums. So. You plug it in how it resonates. This is, I mean, my gosh, we're getting in such good energy tonight. I, I, I mean, I'll take it. I'm just saying. Um, so you plug it in how it resonates. Um, and I just want to say, too, before I get deep into it, uh, me and my daughter just went to Walmart to pick up a couple, just a couple cooking items because she's making dinner tonight, and then I'm going to start the uh, filming for the cooking channel um, for me. But, um we went to go get some basil and cherry tomatoes. But um, anyways, we were out walking in the parking lot in Walmart. And the moon is just so beautiful tonight here um, in Alabama. I'm sure it is in other places too. But it was just, it was like a photo you would see on a calendar or a meme or what have you, what have you. It's really, it's beautiful. It was beautiful. Like butamous. Hashtag butamous. It was that great. Just saying just want to share that but yeah so anyways through many series of chain of events um, a very imbalanced situation is about to be balanced out we have three categories in here one it's in property money finances wealth basically one it is um, regarding love um, the third is in career and opportunities for one of, at least one of you guys it's all three because uh, I heard all uh, for at least for you guys. So, <clears throat> excuse me. So you plug it in how it resonates. Well, that's wonderful. Um, so whoever this is for, now these are psychic intuitive prophetic messages. So one may apply, two may apply, two plus may apply, none may apply. Only you know your specific story and situation, not anybody else. So you please don't force anything that doesn't fit. Please don't, okay? Only take the messages that resonate, leave the rest, okay? But for one, it's um, money, property, finance. Um, yeah, money, property, finances. So I'm thinking the stolen inheritance that I picked up earlier in here, uh, the trust fund baby that you don't know you are with the stolen inheritance, that obviously could fit in category one. Category two, love. So I think somebody's been strategically keeping people back from you. And I was pulling that in here earlier today for category two. For category three, um career opportunities and growth so um and for one it's all of these things so um it sounds like it's about to start be balanced out for you in the universe um it is i heard through many series of chain of events so upcoming like distant horizons energy so upcoming in the universe hopefully not too uh, you know not too far away but 
upcoming. So hasn't happened yet. So um, congratulations to whoever this is for. This is great, great energy. So you plug it in how it resonates. Look what we got on the bottom of the deck. Thief. Somebody stole from you. Category one. Somebody stole from you, but we've been picking that up in here today. Um, and, you know, I've been picking it up for uh, two and a half years. So, But it sounds like somebody's about to get that bounced out. Thief energy for at least one of you guys. Um, and I was picking up in Scorpio's reading. Um, a Scorpio, um, African-American Scorpio is about to get their um, property. Um, some kind of property that uh, their family has been strategically holding back from them, they're about to get it back um, into their position finally. So that might be for that African-American African Scorpio, or it might be for anybody else. You have to plug um, your own specific story and situation into your own, own life, how it tailors and fits into your own specific story and situation. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, pit, I choose. Um... What are you making? The chicken? Um, one, Munster. Sorry, sorry. Dinner time. Share messages you have reflected. Oh my gosh, you can't make this crap up, you guys. Look at this crap. I heard it's upcoming in the universe. Distant Horizons, I was just speaking about that. Distant Horizons, it's upcoming for you. Now, hopefully not too far in the distance, but um, of course, everybody's on different time of life paths, so, you know, you have to plug it in how it resonates, but upcoming. Distant Horizons can be far, this card can be far travel, or it can be um, far like long distance communication, or it can be um, future, futuristic energy, like upcoming in the energetic space. So I feel this is upcoming in the energetic space, distant horizons, upcoming. Number 36 could be a very significant number in one's life, number 36. Spirit messages you have to Main female. Okay, we got high honor reversed. I heard don't take that. Okay, don't take that. Okay, so number 36 or two could be very significant numbers in one's life. Number 36 or two, it could be a possible age of you or somebody you're connected to or any other significant number in one's life. Number 36 or two, distant horizons upright. This is about to happen a lot sooner than you seem to think. For many people, just keep your vibrations high. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. That's beautiful. I heard this is about to happen a lot sooner than you seem to think. Keep your vibrations high. So, you know, there's a difference between low vibrational and high vibrational energy. The high vibrational people uh, treat people with honesty, trust, respect, morals, ethics, integrity, and values. Low vibrational people do not, for anybody, my newbies just joining on the channel. Um, so keep your vibrations high. It's about to happen a lot sooner than you think, but you've got to keep your vibrations high. So treat people with honesty, trust, respect, morals, values, ethics, and integrity. Um, and it's going to happen a lot sooner than you think. So that's beautiful. So upcoming, futuristic. Um, energy here, but sooner than you think if you keep your vib vibrations high. So treat people with honesty, trust, respect, morals, ethics, integrity, and values. So, you know, no stealing, no forgery, no um, no forged POAs. I was pulling that crap in. No um, extortion or money laundering or uh, embezzlement or what have you, what have you. You know, no um, no drugs. 
you know, that's low vibrational activity. I'm trying to think of what's low vibrational, no drugs, um, no anything of low vibration, no prostitution. That's low vibrational too. And I mean, I know some people don't like to hear that, but that is the truth. You're selling your body out for money. That is low vibrational activity. Um, and that's just the truth for real, for real. I know some people don't like to hear that, but it is the truth. Um, so just saying. Main female. For some, some no, some see you as a very strong feminine energy, and you are very strong, high vibrational feminine energy, and you're about to get blessed in many ways. Wow, this is beautiful. For okay, so for um, some of you guys, um, people see you, they view you, so like their perception of you in the um, world, in the energetic space, the three D world we live in. Is a very strong femme energy. So I think you stand on your ethics, your morals, your values, your integrity. Um, no shady, greedy, behind the scenes behavior, basically. Um, you are who you say you are. It's not portraying one thing out in public image and then doing a completely different thing behind the scenes. Um, you are who you say you are. I think people know you are who you say you are. Um, many people view you as a strong femme energy. Um, so I'm speaking to my femme energies here for this particular message. Um, and I heard you're about to get blessed in many ways for this. So you you don't, are you okay? Well, that's a good oven. <laughs> um, so that's beautiful. So you are who you say you are. You're not false pretenses. You don't hide who you, you know, saying one thing out public, doing a completely different thing in private. You are who you say you are. You're very high vibrational. People view you as strong, as like a leader as type energy. I didn't hear that, but that's what I'm intuitively feeling here, like a strong leader as type energy. And you're about to get blessed in the universe, whether it's getting stolen money, property, or um, stolen property, money, investments, what have you, what have you, in the financial department back, or getting career growth and opportunities or um, love coming towards you. And I did hear love. Like, I didn't hear a booty call. I didn't hear um, um, hit it or quit it. I didn't hear a sneaky link. I heard love. Like, the freaking real deal. Like, I'm presuming. Um, that's strong. And, you know, I don't hear love in here a lot. Y'all know that. I did do a twin flame reading today. I heard twin today. Which I haven't heard Twin Flame in a long time. Y'all know that. Um, but the last time I heard Twin was a false twin. But that, that's even been like six or seven or eight months ago or something. So, I mean, the energy shifting. It is shifting. It is shifting. It is shifting. And whoever this particular message or message is for, you're a strong femme energy. And you're about to get blessed in the universe for it. I'm feeling leadership here. Um, if it's the career growth and opportunities, I'm feeling leadership. For some of you guys and i'm just being for real possibly uh for some it could just be people view you as a leader um that's really beautiful energy if that resonates for you let me see if i hear anything else And for one, a significant feminine energy in a position of high authority, she's about to help you in huge ways. Fulfill your dreams and career growth and opportunity. You're a masculine energy. Okay. And for one of you guys, you're a masculine energy. Um, whoever you are, sir or ma'am. I will assert you're a sir. Or you could be a, um, a sir that likes to be called ma'am. But you, are, you have a penile part. You're a masculine energy. 
Um, I heard um, a femme energy. I think a position of high authority, femme energy, uh, leadership person in a leadership role. I'm feeling high vibrational. It's going to help you fulfill your career growth and um, goals soon. So if that message applies for you, you're a masculine energy. And a femme, I'm feeling position of high authority because she has the authority and power and um, strings to pull and um, to, to be able to help you, basically. I mean, so I'm, she's, she's a position of authority and I'm just being for real. If that resonates for you. Um, congratulations, sir. If that resonates for you, um, that's really beautiful. Let's see if we hear anything else. So in this aspect, you're masculine energy and I feel she's going to be a manager, boss, supervisor, or CEO. She might end up being a mentor to you possibly, sir. Um, I didn't hear she was going to be, but she might be. You plug it in how it resonates. And for one masculine energy, you're about to meet the love of your life, twin flame. And for one, you're about to reconnect with your twin flame. I've been hearing twin today. My God. Okay, so for if this resonates for you, you're masculine energy. And um, I heard soon you're going to upcoming reconnect with your twin for one. And for one, you're going to um, meet your twin. So... You haven't even met your twin yet, and y'all are going to go into energetic connection. For one, um, this is your twin in this aspect. It's your twin. The main main female is your twin. Uh, it hasn't happened yet. It's about to. Uh, for one, for one, you're about to reconnect with your twin. So you've already met your twin. You've already energetically connected with your twin in the universe, and you're about to re reconcile with them, reconnect with them. So, and that, that hasn't happened yet either. So you plug it in how it resonates. Wow, man. Okay. Let's pull one more. This is a good reading, man. This is a good one. Experiment to just you have to touch it. Marriage? Oh, my good Lord. And thoughts? Number 16 or 3 could be a very significant number of one's life. Number 16 or 3. Marriage? And for one, you're going to be invited to a wedding soon. It's about to inspire you in many ways. And for one, you're about to be invited to a wedding soon. It's about to inspire you in many ways. So for one, if this message applies for you, I feel you can be a masculine or feminine. Um, you're about to be, you're, you are about to be invited to a wedding. So in this aspect, this is you about to be invited to um, somebody's wedding. So not your wedding, obviously. It's somebody else's wedding and it's going to inspire you in many ways. So inspire you in some shape, form, or fashion. Um in some way however that resonates for you sir man if that resonates for you and a divorce is about to free somebody in huge positive ways and a divorce is about to free somebody in huge positive ways so for one of you guys, you're in the middle of a divorce or you're about to be in the middle, middle of a divorce. I feel you can be masculine or femme, however that resonates and applies for you. But a divorce is about to free you in huge positive ways. So in this aspect, you're still legally married, but I feel it's a miserable marriage and I'm just being for real. Um, I'm not trying to demean anybody, but I'm just tell you how it is on here. And Obviously, if you're getting a divorce, it's for miserable reasons. Um, obviously, it's not growing and manifesting the way you want it to. So, um, when you get divorced, marriage reversed, it's going to free you in positive ways. So, hey, no judgments here. I've been divorced one time. No judgments here. 
Um, I believe in doing what makes you happy in a very healthy, copacetic, positive way. Um, as long as you're putting positive into the universe. Um, that's the way I look at it. Of course, you know, I can only speak on my thoughts and ideals, you know, just saying, just saying. Let's see if we have anything else. And for one, you're about to get engaged. And for one, you're about to get engaged. And for one, you're about to get engaged. What? Congrats to whoever's about to get engaged. It hasn't happened yet. It hasn't happened yet. It's upcoming and you're about to get engaged. So I don't, I think you're about to get proposed to. Um, that's what I think. Or you're about to propose. Energies can be reversed. I just heard you're about to get engaged. So either you're going about to propose propose to somebody or somebody's about to propose to you. I can't speak tonight. Um, you plug it in how it resonates, sir, ma'am. Wow. Okay, I didn't hear anything else. All right, you guys, we're done. I love you guys so much. Everybody have a good night and namaste.